Denise Watkins with Skyview Skateland. It's exciting to talk to you about your experience with the social media management certificate program at State that we've taught for many years. Well, Martin, it's a pleasure to be with you today. I believe we actually first met at uh, one of the small business centers in Tarboro, North Carolina. And that was probably in maybe the spring of 2016. And of course, uh, you were always challenging and putting new things out there for me to learn and to grasp, to incorporate in my business. And then I started to see your mentions and advertisements, promos of your the certificate program being offered in NC State. So, of course, I reached out to you and I said, do you think that would be a good thing for me to take? And you said, certainly. So, of course, I'm so glad I did because taking that class helped me put all the pieces of the puzzle together. You know, just your social media marketing is one component, but then you're going to see how that ripples out and you need other components for a, a better complete picture of what your business looks like. It's been a real journey to learn everything about social media. And of course, I don't know that you ever really learn it all because it's always changing and you want to stay on top and current and relevant for everything there. But it's been a great journey, a lot of fun. Your monthly meetings with your graduates is probably the biggest resource that has the most value because we just come together and we share what's going on in our communities. And then we hear what other people are doing, maybe with challenges as well as successes. And it's always uh, building our program better and stronger. Excellent. And what was it like being in the class? Because to me, one of the greatest joys of teaching is the interaction and meeting other people on the journey in the, the social media management, because we have 12 weeks to work together. And then, of course, like you said, we have the free ongoing monthly meetings where we share the latest updates and tips. So the community builds far beyond that initial event. And I guess probably... I must have taken it in 2017, maybe 2018 in the summer. And there were probably about 18 students physically. You know, we were in the classroom. So you got to know a couple of those folks. Uh, I'm still connected with a few of them. I follow their pages and social media. Uh, some are businesses, actual businesses, and then some of them are supporting other businesses. Being able to hear how they may use something in their business. You know, there's so many different businesses participating in this. So you get to see a pretty wide spectrum of the types of businesses and then see the application or the practical use of social media and reaching uh, out to your target market. So you get ideas from others. You just see how maybe you can adapt something for your business. Maybe they have a great idea that you learn from. And then, of course, at the end, when we each made our presentations, it was great to see how we all have grown and what our plans were for the future, you know, with uh, having this knowledge and this certificate behind us now, just being, I guess, introduced to some of the concepts that were taught there. I was just talking with my husband earlier this morning, how much I have grown over the years just from from knowing you, Martin, as well as the influence that you have played over my business. You've grown me personally. You've grown me professionally. You know, my age group, we didn't have computers growing up. Uh, even when I was in college, you know, there were no computers on the scene. So this whole platform is totally foreign to my generation. 
And it's so rewarding when some of my younger customers come in and they'll say, oh, Miss Denise, you look so good out there on social media. <laughs> or they'll tell me, I'm following you on social media. So um, when they affirm what I'm doing, I, I must be doing something correctly. Yes. It's, it's a good been, feeling. It's such, it's such a joy to have you in the class and all the participants, because to me, part of the value is the capstone project they work on throughout the class. And it's a very supportive environment. It's not a shark tank type thing. And then also the interaction and the friendships and the allies you build during the 12 weeks that then can extend far beyond it and have. And this is part of the joy as one of the instructors of it, of offering this and seeing how people keep growing and then seeing someone go, wow, they're doing something new out there. And they're, they're, they've gotten their career advanced and they got a new job and, or they got promoted inside their company. And all those have been wonderful over the years with over about over 250 participants we've had because they're all small classes designed to not be big classes, but small classes where we can really give individual assistance. So great fun. And how can people learn more about you and what you have to offer in North Carolina? Well, you can find me on the web at uh, skyviewskateland.com. We spell the view a little different, V-U-E. That actually stems from a drive-in theater days. My parents first built a drive-in theater in 1947, and then they built the skating rink in 1958. So we used to just say Skyview a lot of times in case you were calling the drive-in or the skating rink, you got the right folks. But uh, you can find us on the web. We're on Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, and YouTube. Right now, my... Um, challenges to get better at my videoing. Uh, as you know, my customers come in to skate with me, I'm seeing all kinds of things that I need to be putting on video. As Martin will tell you, it's a muscle you have to develop. And being able to act like a reporter, think like a reporter, see like a reporter, it is a muscle that you will develop over time. And you'll begin to say, mm, that'll be some good content right there. I can make a video of that. Or that would be something my followers would love to watch. Excellent. Excellent. Thanks so much, Denise. And thank you. And uh, I just appreciate all you've done to assist me, Martin. I really call you my mentor uh, to my friends and colleagues when they ask me questions or things, and I tell them, really, you are uh, the person that had me and put me on the track of digital marketing. Excellent. Thanks. Thank you.